Section two, concepts of digital cameras. Now that you know how to use your camera in full auto mode, allow us to discuss some of the basic concepts of digital cameras and photography so you have a foundation to learn how to use your camera in much more powerful and creative ways. To begin, a digital camera is comprised of four main parts. First, a lens which magnifies an image, focuses that image, and determines how much or how little light will enter the camera. Second, a shutter assembly, which reflects the image into the viewfinder so you can see it, and which opens when you press the shutter button for a very precise period of time in order to expose the image sensor to the focused image. Third, an image sensor is a silicon chip that, like film in older cameras, is exposed to an image and precisely records that image so it can be converted into a digital file for storage on a memory card. Fourth, a memory card stores images until the images are archived on a PC hard drive or burned to a CD and deleted from the memory card. A tip, it may be convenient to use multiple memory cards. When one card is full, simply insert a new one and continue shooting pictures. Memory cards can be used to store images either permanently or temporarily, although the least expensive way to archive your images is to burn them to a high quality CD and then store them in a safe, cool, and dry place. To remove your memory card, simply open the memory card cover and press the eject button like this. Caution, handle your memory card with care and never remove it if the red access light on the camera is on. You'll want to get into the habit of protecting your great photos on your camera from accidentally being erased. To do this, simply press the menu button and then use the quick control dial to select the protect option and press the set button. Then scroll through your images using your quick control dial and press the set button for each image you want to protect. 